Hi, I'm Shorty and welcome back to my YouTube channel, Shorty Skate Series. Today I'm going to show you how I'm going to cut down my kingpins. As you can see here, my kingpin is a little bit taller than my disco truck. So disco trucks are designed to be a wide truck for stability, not necessarily 50-50 grinds or 50-50 stalls. However, you can grind and stall on them, um, but you just might need to modify your kingpin a little bit. So I did a bit of Googling um, as to different ways you could cut down a bolt. You could use a belt sander, um, different grinding machines. I even tried to use bolt cutters, but I wouldn't recommend that as I kind of messed up a kingpin I was practicing on and I sort of messed up the thread so I couldn't actually get the nut off any longer. So don't do that one. Today I'm actually going to do use a Dremel. This is a cutting disc, so I'm going to try and cut down the bolt as much as I can and then probably use the grinding disc to just smooth it out a little bit so here we go so the Dremel I used was the Dremel 3000 I bought it with a 30 piece accessory kit um, you can see the color coding down here for the different types of accessories the one I used to cut down the kingpins is this cutting disc which is the 426 and then to sand down or grind down the kingpins just to make it a bit smoother is this one, which I use the 541, which is a grinding disc. As always, it's safety first. Remember to use eye protection when using a Dremel so that the metal shavings don't fly into your eyes. So I thought the best technique would be to come at the kingpin at all different angles. So that's why I took off my disco truck axle and the wheels. This was my first time using a Dremel, so I was very cautious. So I was getting a little nervous as I got closer to cutting through the kingpin. So I decided to get some pliers and try and break it off, which ended up being successful. Then the rain started to become a little bit heavier, so I thought I would stop and wait for it to finish. By the time it finished, my husband Baba came home and he really wanted to give it a go, so I let him. He was able to cut through the whole kingpin just using the cutting disc. It was also his first time using a Dremel. By the time he got to the second boot, he was able to just cut through it in a single go rather than having to rotate the boot around. So we could have just left the kingpins as they were as the cut was quite um, level. But me being a perfectionist, I wanted to make it super smooth. So then we changed over the Dremel to have the grinding disc. And we just did a little bit of grinding to make it flush with the kingpin nut. Because I like to switch out my narrow and wide trucks quite often, I needed to make sure that I didn't damage the kingpin when cutting it. Um, and as you can see here, it was quite easy to remove and put the nut back on. So this is what it looks like with my disco trucks assembled. So you'll notice my kingpin is still just a tiny bit higher than my disco truck. But as you'll see from the following video clips, it doesn't impact me on doing my 50-50 grinds on rails, boxes or mini ramps. So I hope this video is helpful if you're looking to try and cut down your kingpins. If you have any questions, please comment below and I'll try and get back to you as soon as I can. Thank you for watching and please like and share this video if you found it helpful. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more skating tips and tricks.